We're with Coach Jeff McMartin, Central College, a 45-19 winner over DePauw. Sounds easy, it wasn't. Dutch trailing 13-0 in the first quarter. What was happening in the first quarter? They looked like they were getting a lot of pressure on their quarterback, for one thing. Yeah, we knew they had a very good defensive line. They're very well coached, and, and uh, you know, last year they sacked us five times, so we knew we were going to be in for a great challenge. Um, you know, we didn't have great field position, and we were kind of, we weren't able to get out of there. But I think really the our our struggles in the punt game are really what uh, kind of put us in in a jam there. You're down 13 nothing. Yeah, a bad snap on a on a punt, which gave them ball deep in the territory, and that did set up the second touchdown for DePaul. Dutch also ran the ball better though yep. as the game wore on, and uh, uh, just conditioning, defense, offensive think, line taking over. Yeah, I mean, I think our tempo helped us. And uh, that was a big part of the game was, you know, being able to, uh, you know, just stay on the field, get first downs, move the ball. You know, when you're rushing the passer a lot, I mean, that can wear you out. And uh, I think that we, we were able to get the ball off and, you know, get a first down or gain yards and then run another play. And so we used tempo really well. I think Coach Meyer did a nice job from a play calling standpoint of, you know, kind of mixing it up and then uh, just changing tempos. And I think that that wore them down and allowed us to run the ball better in the second half. And last week, Hunter Robinson with a career day today. Tanner Schmeke comes up big, seven catches, 119 yards. What do you think about Tanner today? I think Tanner, you know, he's an explosive player, and he did a great job. Um, you know, we've got a nice re re group of receivers this year, and um, certainly a, a luxury for Blaine. You know, Blaine does a really good job of knowing where to go with it, and if one guy is covered or a certain area is covered, he had time to kind of come off of that. So give our offensive line a lot of credit, too, and, and find a secondary guy, and he did a great job there. Um, Special teams did struggle early, as you said, but you also got some big special teams play. Hunter Robinson with a, a huge return that set up a touchdown. Yeah, we had some really good returns. Um, also blocked an extra point, uh, and I think that was big. And then, the, you know, they missed another one. But I think we put good pressure on the kicker and did a really nice job there. Uh, I think, you know, for the most part. And we had a big field goal. Uh, it was a long field goal and a tough one. Uh, but I was really happy with how we kicked the ball as well. And uh, defense turned it around as well. Felt like early the Paw quarterback had some time to throw, but then as the game wore on, put a lot of pressure out of pass rush. He did. We got some sacks. We got pressure. We got him out of his out of the pocket. I think Coach uh, Mulder did a really good job of uh, calls and the coverage calls that he was putting on there. I thought we were able to kind of challenge uh, the looks that he was getting pre-snap to post-snap, and I think that was helpful for us and made him hold the ball a little bit longer. Uh, we took away some of the things they wanted to do, and I thought we made some really good adjustments. So I was really happy with the game plan and how that we executed it during the game. It's hard, you know. Th this is a challenge game because. We have no film that they hadn't played before. You're just kind of going off of what happened last year and, you know, in-game in game adjustments, and that's really what we had to do today. Well, good job. 45-19 winner, Dutch 2-0. It's a great start. Thanks. Appreciate it.